Hello, I'm Dr. Nathan Way. There's a story from ancient times that described what was called the Gordian Knot. This was a knot made of many ropes that many men tried to untie but couldn't. The legend is that whoever could solve the mystery of the Gordian Knot would rule all of Asia. Alexander the Great heard about the situation and solved it by cutting through the knot with one blow of his sword. And that brings us up to another Gordian knot situation we face today. Why is osteoarthritis cartilage damage so hard to treat? Osteoarthritis is the disease of hyaline cartilage, the tough gristle that caps the ends of long bones. Cartilage is composed of cells, collagen, proteoglycans, and water. It's an interesting compound because it is both pliable as well as stiff. The cells inside of cartilage are called chondrocytes. They sit inside the matrix of proteoglycans, collagen, and water and are sort of like grapes inside a gelatin mold. When cartilage is damaged, it has a limited ability to repair itself. Chondrocytes are just not capable of doing it, and cartilage damage leads to further chondrocyte death. And this leads to osteoarthritis. Multiple techniques have been used to try and rectify this problem. The first is microfracture. This is a procedure where the surgeon drills multiple holes into the cartilage and underlying bone, leading to bleeding and the release of some mesenchymal stem cells from the marrow. Mosaic plasty is a procedure where plugs of normal cartilage and bone are plugged into the area where cartilage damage has occurred. Autologous chondrocyte implantation is a technique where a cartilage plug is harvested from a non-wake bearing part of the knee, digested with enzymes in the lab, and the chondrocytes are stimulated to multiply. The chondrocytes are then re-implanted with a second arthroscopy into the area of cartilage damage and kept there by a thin membrane that is sewn into place. All of these attempts have a long recovery an excessive number of complications, as well as an excessive amount of chondrocyte death around the margins. So far, the most promising approach has been the use of mesenchymal stem cells. These are adult stem cells that are programmed to become connective tissue such as cartilage. I invite you to contact us for a free portfolio of information on how stem cells can help you if you have osteoarthritis you'll discover more details about the procedure and most importantly, the results. Thanks for watching.